Hey guys and gals. Hey, it's uh, Friday afternoon after work up here at the farm. We're in the uh, pecan orchard and you can see, man, the trees are coming out. The grass is growing. It's uh, looking pretty good. So what are we doing today? Well, in this orchard, there is 150 pecan trees. Well, let me rephrase that. There was 148. We planted 150. We lost two the first year. We had to come back and do some replacement trees. Then uh, a couple of years later, we had a really hard winter and we lost two more. So these are trees that we actually raised at Heritage Farms and uh, replacement pecan trees. And I have a video out there you guys can watch. We'll put a link up here to the playlist for pecans and you can go find it. But yeah, so we grew these trees from seed, but you can see right here. So I just planted it and notice how the, the, uh, the base or the trunk of the tree has an angle over to the right, if you will. And the reason we placed it in that position, and you can see I've got it tied pretty tight. So that tree is actually leaning a little bit like that because this is the south and we get tremendous south winds. So over time, you'll see most of these trees in this orchard, if you look at the trunks, they have a little bit of a bow to the south. And the reason we do that is so that when the wind blows over time, the tree grows straight. And uh, so that's what we did right here. We have this thing facing south, leaning a little bit to the south. You can see the base of the trunk is straight, and then it goes a little bit to the south and that will actually help that tree lean into the wind over time because our uh, spring winds are uh, terrible, almost like the Santa Ana winds in California. But all right, so that's one tree we've planted and that is from a native rootstock. And we'll let this thing get a little bit bigger and we'll come back in a year or two from now and we'll graft another uh, top onto that. We'll come from one of these trees, take a cutting, grafted onto this base. We want the native seed stock that's from this area so that you got the roots and the uh, tap root and everything is accustomed to the soil and uh, just makes for a more hardy tree, but that's down the road. So I'm gonna take a minute and I'm gonna go over and show you the other uh, tree that we just finished planting and uh, give you an update on it. Okay, well, we're on the uh, other side of the orchard now. And uh, here is the other tree that we planted today. Same principle, we got it leaning into the uh, south. This one had a few more leaves on it, a little bit bigger. But I tell you what, getting it in the ground this time of the year, get some of these rains on it. We got the sprinklers set on a timer now. So hopefully we can get this thing flowing and it can get off to a good start and uh, start to do something. So there you go replacement trees grown at Heritage Farms at our corporate offices, transplanted to the pecan orchard. All right, so now we're back to having 150 trees in the ground. We'll see what happens. Hey guys, hope you enjoyed this video. Leave us a comment, thumbs up, and uh, tell me about your pecan trees or pecan orchard. We'd love to hear from you. And as always, glory be to God.